Hey, welcome back, YouTube. SKS here with another episode of No Man's Sky. Last time we left off, we're gonna finish this, I think. We were at like 98%. Look at these clouds. They're trying to build up, they're just not happening. Alright. Let's see what we have here. This may be the last one in this, and then we'll go back to the new base and uh, get that guy uh, his chromatic metal he wants. Archive for user iteration lost unavailable. Possible remote terminus backup available. Download coordinates. Follow coordinates. Oh, we gotta go somewhere else? Really? Oh, we may be going someplace new. Well, if that's the case, let's make sure our starship's all fueled up. Ready to go. We got uranium for the launch thrusters, which we don't need. We got some emerald the other day. Need to put this frigate fuel up on the actual frigate, but... Pulse engine's ready to go. My pulse engine is still slow with all this drive power. Uh, we got frost crystals to make lots of glass. And I found some deoxite. So... We should be in really good shape. We got so much navigation data. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Maybe sell some of it. But let's see where we need to go. Maybe it's some place we've been before. Over here, so we're away from the planet interference. I do like going on trips, so this should be fun. Let's uh, solve our galaxy map and see what we got going on. We've not been here. Oh, do we got to go to Gubardi Eevee? It's got six things. Watch this be like a perfect area that we could have put another base. But uh, for now, we're going to head there. All right, we're in the Gubardi EV system. Six planets. It is industrial and developing. Feet there as well. What kind of planet is this? The rocky planet. We're not going there first. You're going here. Jordbori Gamma. Isotropic. This ought to be fun. Aggressive Sentinels. Oh man, you gotta love that. We'll definitely have to check out the star base here, but I spent a lot off screen of my nanites on Exocraft updates, so I don't think we'll be able to get anything. We'll see what we got here. Obviously, I'm gonna take some time to scan. Oh, we're gonna go through this cloud. Oh, that's so cool. Oh. Okay. Oh, we got eggs here. Is it going to force my hand? I think it is. Radioactive dust storms, aggressive sentinels, common flora frequent. Okay. This place is legit. Um, let me scan this stuff and then we'll debate what else we'll do. Uh, let's see what the name is here. It is. We've got a storm approaching. The Rypor Badlands. Okay. Alright. Let's go in here since we got this storm. I'll think about these uh, eggs. There's the Forgotten Terminal, but we'll see what else is in here. Death. That's probably what else is in here. Up there that wants to hurt me. Should have left that the jerk face. Plays javelin hit a little bit harder. Not much though. Still don't know if I like it. All right, let's check out this terminal and see what else we got here. I have reached the location and marked by my base computer. The remote archive terminal hums, awaiting my input. Access memory. 
Attempting to ring memory at 0x000FF1A. That's probably a color. We sought an escape from reality. That's why we're all here, isn't it? Oh god, are we like in a... We're hooked up to a computer and travelers are just part of this entity. I can remember what it's like to be a traveler, to have that hope, that intolerable thirst for the new. I should never have listened to you, my love. There is no fire in this place, no trophies fit for gods. There is only darkness. The family of glass, they watch everything. Search physical cache. Search physical cache attached to the terminal. Whoever recorded this message also left a piece of technology. Scanner module B. Oh, we gotta wait six hours for the next one? Oh my god. Um, I don't think we need this scanner module, to be honest with you. I don't think we have any room for it. I don't know if it'll go there. We could try. No, it breaks it. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, I should have just... That's what I thought. Alright, that's fine. Alright, the storm is clearing up. So let's... Uh... Wow, six hours. Okay. I wonder if we gotta come back to this one. Uh oh. Hey, buddy. Get out of here. Right, we'll get out of here way before the reinforcements. Silly aggressive sentinels. Alright, we'll go back to the starbase. Oh, hostile. So oh, somebody gonna come fight me? Okay. I wonder if they're gonna find anything on me. They want my pulse in no, they okay. Usually it tells you if they've uh, found something they like. Let's see what you got, buddy. Oh yeah, do a barrel roll. Okay, that was very effective. Wow. Okay. Another one? Oh, these are the Sentinels, aren't they? Oh, okay. We could take them down. Then we'll go to the base. I wish when you hit them, you actually damage certain systems. Yeah, we're, we're... Oh, good lord, there's another one. Alright, we got him. Alright, let's get out of here. New item recorded to catalog. Explosive drones. Oh, good lord. Let's hit the space station. We'll see if they get anything fun. We'll learn some words. And then we'll teleport to our new base. Alright, I think we're good inside the base. Barty EV Rendezvous. We got up here Gex. Another journey milestone. Destroyed 10 Sentinels. We're a nuisance. We haven't really uh, went after Sentinels yet. Got an S class fighter sitting over here, but it's one of the smaller ones. There it goes. I would love to get one of the bigger fighters, but I've not seen those yet. That, that would be my next upgrade. I would instantly buy an S like heavy fighter that had like lots of more storage. Alright, let's check out oh we get an exosuit upgrade. I forgot we're in a new place. 
Definitely probably need this on cargo. Oh, general may be nice too. No, we'll go cargo. It's 850,000 for that. This is 50,000. Um, I mean, we got the cash. We really could probably use another other cargo. I'm gonna have to do some more drop pods. We need to fill this out. I'm gonna spend the money even though that's probably a bad move, but I'm gonna put my chromatic metal there and then this pugnium and then that frees up. Need to sell these explosive drones. I forgot that I had those. But let's see what they've got here for exosuit upgrades. Toxic and movement. The movement would be nice, but I don't think we have any room for that. We could use a movement. Though, we don't technically need it yet. Alright, let's see what you got. I'm going to take your nav data. I need to sell a bunch of that. Pleasure to meet, friend. I am blank sales geck. I blank my blank. Uh, nothing really good for him. Not a good place for that. What kind of gun do you got, sir? B class. Heavy probe. See, I don't understand. These are just little bitty ones. Um, I'd like to have one of the big experimental ones. It's like a rifle. Because they're supposed to be powerful. And then there's like alien ones. I guess they're exotics. Welcome to Gek Lao. Best blank. Happy to blank something. Alright, anything? Plasma launcher. So yeah, nothing, nothing really here. I'm gonna go back over there and sell those one parts, and then, uh... You guys got anything back here for me to plunder? I like these backroom bars. They're, like, cool. I can't get in that. I need to, I make, need to make the V3 virtual pass. Alright, so... Some of the missions that I picked up... <clears throat> are delivery missions. Um... And they're on this planet. So uh, I'll go do that, and that'll give us a trading post and some neat shuttles. There's a, you know, for them to say that like you got to go to the richer systems for the the big ones. I mean, we got a lot of A's and B's and that S showing up here, but maybe on that planet, I'll go deliver this real quick. We'll have something amazing come up. Like I said, we're, we got like a medium fighter. I think there is a large fighter that holds a lot more and has a lot more slots. So that would be something amazing to get a hold of. And I'm going to guess about 40 million. So uh, I would have the money for that. That's what I've been saving up for. But we'll see. We'll just have to run into it. Okay, we can see now, kind of. From how I landed. Thank you. Is there a storm, a firestorm going on? 575 degrees outside. This planet is a spicy a meatball. I thought maybe we could learn some words at the... Uh, Look at that. It's a sea fighter. 15-2. Yeah, these firestorms suck. Alright, let's deliver the goods and I'll learn some words. Alright, I have um, delivered the goods, learned some woods. This planet is still hot even without a storm. Check out this fighter. I don't like this color, but B-25, it's about the same as mine. So, I don't know if they've got the large fighters here, so we may just have to be uh, mindful. But our next drop-off is three hours this other way. I've not scanned anything on this planet. Um, it says it's six minutes, so I'll go up and back down and uh, meet you there. This place is called Adramanim, Adramalim. A Dromlin Noas. Interesting place. Very hot planet. I 
I'd say the atmosphere would probably destroy most ships coming in. Straight down landing, we'll take it. Lots of minerals on the hills. Alright, let me go deliver this paraffinium off and scan some things and learn some words. Alright, there's very few planets that I say are hell holes. This is a hell hole. Weird looking ships coming in, these haulers. When I was looking around scanning a few things, I did look over here and notice this. Manufacturing facility with sentinels around it, so we'll probably head over that way. Alright, let's see. Do we gotta bust into this place? My guess is yes. Wait, we go from 203 to negative 90 something? We got a reinforced door here. Um. Alright, we're in. Hopefully we can understand enough of the language to, uh... Really? In here? I didn't know they could come inside. I think we'll be good, though, because they're going to be searching and he won't find me. Alright, let's do our thing. The well of alarm fills my ears, but the system is not reacting to my intrusion. Someone else has been here and modified this terminal before. I struggle to decipher the data of the terminal. Warning. What about system? Something. Oh, man. Gek Trade Federation informed. Whatever code has been loaded on the terminal is clearly the work of some enterprising thief. It appears to be emptying the resource vaults of rare metals. We could attempt to further hijack or revert the system. Let's revert it. I reset the system back to its default production loadout. Things appear to be operating as expected. Normal operations have resumed, and I have access to the facility's main control panel. I should be able to alter production to my own benefit. Multi-tool expansion slot, nanites, or a recipe. We'll do recipes. Um, I think there may be some stuff that we... Oh, lubricant! We need that for a quest! That is a big find there. And then we get one more, right? Um... Living glass. Lubricant and glass. Stable gel. Polyfiber. Wow, we could have made a ton of that at the place. I don't think there's anything else here we need. Unstable plasmas for certain weapons. Oxygen capsule. A Humboldt drive. It's for the submarine. I feel like we'll get that later on in a quest. Um. Uh, portable reactor. I'll just get that. That one was a really good find. Uh, Wall of Flames coming, so let's, uh. Ugh. Get out of here. Oh, we'll, we'll, let's find the name of this place. I'm sure it's going to be something exciting. And the name of this area is... The Oruza Flats, I think. This place is awful. Get me out of here. I've never wanted to go home so bad. We'll go to the mission, dude. Turn these in and then teleport to the main base. And then I'm going to put in some windows. All right, here's the mission guy. Let's see what we get for all that. I think it was some nanites and probably some other junk we can sell. 
And emissions. All right, uranium. We got some credits. And merchant's guild standing, which I'm still not figured out that stuff yet. Oh. Well. That there. Pugnium goes into cargo now. Let's give this Gek Relic to somebody. Hey, you. Captain Apps. Offer a relic. Very happy about it. Alright. I help you, friend. You help the Gek? Uh, oh, I guess I did turn that in. So it gave me this stuff. Uh, 15 creatures. Yeah, we need to do that. I've got a bunch of those missions stored up. Probably on my home planet where my base is, I need to drive around and find... 11 creatures, 15. The poop here is 247 nanites, but I think I'm going to have to feed animals. Alright. That's good. Let's sell some stuff and then teleport to base. Alright, we're back home, so let me make some glass. I'll make 10, just to start off. And uh, I know that I wanted to put some, like, on these walkways, which we will eventually. Your boy. Give him some windows. I know he kind of wanted some. Oh man, look at the view he's going to have now. Yeah, you've got, you've got, oh man. There are, there's already a corner window, right? No. But we're going to put more people here, so. Or maybe we only put two. Put him, and then we'll put the Corvex, and then the other guys will be down the hall. And I can always change it. Wow, that really brightened the place up. Yeah, a window here wouldn't really help, but... This is really nice. Alright, uh... I've got your chromatic metal. There you are again, Traveler. I'm sure you have the required materials this time. The overseer speaks strangely, implying that we have performed this encounter before. I have no memory of such meetings. I asked who paid them for the service and they're performing for me. They laugh and claim that my child did many years from now. I do not know what they're talking about. The overseer asked me for the chromatic metal. Chromatic metal. Perfect, friend. I knew you would succeed. Just what I need to finish the science terminal plans. Alright, so we can make a science terminal. Stuck in... There we go. Rudsy, we have littered the universe in our greed, Traveler. This planet is no exception, but there's much that we can done with litter. Make your way to an abandoned structure and harvest the data from their terminals. I shall use it to fashion us plans for a storage container. Oh, maybe he'll give me the other storage containers. Sales Gek Rudsy is reflective for Gek. They almost seem to regret the greed that characterizes their people. They wish to make something new from the remains of the old. Is this just greed in disguise or something else? Whatever their motive, the Overseer claims I will find data for a storage container blueprint in a nearby structure. You won't regret it, friend. I marked you a site that seems to be ripe for exploration. Alright, let's build this uh, science. Put that right over here. All right, it's it. we'll, we'll find a science Corvax, but again, it all comes down. I like Rudsy's name. We'll find the name for the other one. So let's go down the hall here and put in some more windows. Because windows are needed everywhere. That's a good view. Oh, yeah, as I was gonna say, I don't think a window helps there. Yeah, these other ones are nice. Here. Yeah, I want to change all of these. How many glass do I have? I just have one. It goes fast, but those frost crystals are easy to farm. Now that I know what I'm looking for. 
Oh yeah, definitely need windows here. That looks nice. We'll have to put something secretive in the bottom areas. I don't know, may maybe I need to... No, no, no. Yeah, I like it just this back half not that way. All right. What are you? Why? Why are you in my base? Like seriously, Rishu Knight, get out! Like they really need to work on the bases, like being immune to certain things. It's uh, I'm gonna go in here. There we go. I'm gonna add some uh, windows in here. Oh, we don't. Got to make some more glass. Yeah, um, we did the middle one. Oh, we can do them on the outside. Yeah, we'll just have to go outside and look and see what this looks like. And there's also, I probably need to put a ladder in here. Get down to. Bottom part. Then uh, put some windows in here. Not too many in this one because. Uh, get dirt here. Well, you know what? Screw it. Think here. Uh, yeah, maybe. No, no. Don't need one there. I don't think we need this one either. Because then we just got them on the front sections. So I guess one needs to go there. Well, this is a cool view, too. I like this. But like a cozy. I don't know how I want to put it. I guess you put it something like that. Up a little. There we go. Nice little couch in here. You come down. Just sit down here and kind of relax. Take in the view, watch some spaceships land. Look at the rainbow. Oh, that's nice. See the stupid creatures flying through your base? All right, back at it, though. Yeah, it doesn't affect it whatsoever. All right, maybe we need to put some windows. I don't know. I like those curved windows that we have and nothing else. And I can always... Uh, our oxygen meter is still going. I feel like we have so much oxygen now that that's like not even needed. I mean, I could put windows down through here. But I think it would be kind of overkill. I really need to finish putting the, uh, the walls. Metal walls are definitely... Um, Need to knock these out, but I'm gonna need ferrite dust. So, other than that, I really like the way it's going. Hopefully, we do the other quest, and I think we can knock those out next time. And uh, 
I need to put some kind of roof on here. Oh, wait. I did buy uh, flags. We could start with these. And then we'll uh, we'll do something else later on with them. <clears throat> Actually, put some right here too. They're all blowing in different directions. I don't know if like that. How come they don't blow the way of the wind? You know? Because my guess would be the wind would be blowing from the ocean. Oh no! I have more pure ferrite. That's fine. That's fine. I'll put the other one there eventually. All I really got to do is uh, just uh, mine one of the big things down here. I'll get my pure ferrite. And we'll capstone this episode with this flag being put up here properly. There we go. All right, we got some flags. Adds a little bit of character to the base. We've added some windows. Got a lot of creatures all about. So this thing makes a lot of noise. Like I wish it turned off when you weren't in it. All right, let's go in here. We'll load down a save, and then next time we're gonna get a scientist. Get out of my base! I'm sure it's gonna make him an enemy. Or he could just not care. Okay. Who knows? Who knows? Alright, next time we're gonna do the Corvax quest, get the storage thing. And then, once again, I don't know how to use stairs. Oh my god, they kill me. And uh, we'll get the quarterback scientist, and then I wish we'd get some more visitors. I wonder why we're not. Maybe I need to put a little trade thing out here. I don't know. Alright gamers, hope you're enjoying the series. Go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe if you're not. Hit the notification bell, still only about 8% of you uh, have the notifications going. But as always, thanks for watching, God bless. I will see you all next time. Good night everybody. And great thanks to the March Patreon, Zachary McKinley, Nicholas Abser, Azure Rain, James Matisse, The Least Expected, Party Commissar.